Hey, what's up? I'm Al Cox. I make games, play games, and everything in between. And today, I'm going to show you how to add texture to your objects in BuildBox. So let's go. Before I begin, don't forget to like and subscribe as I create content around making games with the focus in BuildBox. In BuildBox, you can add textures to your objects. There's a lot of free websites that you can get textures from. The one that I found is polygon.com. As you can see, they have a lot of textures. And all these textures you can use in your BuildBox games. I have a little bit of trouble with the metallic ones, but cool things like bricks, rusty objects, or rocky objects can totally be used. Let's take a look at these objects in BuildBox. So here's the objects in BuildBox right now. As we can see, the brick looks really cool. And I kind of want to zoom in on that brick. So we can go here. And we can see this brick looks like a brick wall. And it's not just one brick wall, but it's multiple walls like here. And then of course we can make this bigger. And then it's like one huge wall. Now I do want to state that the text your scale is set to five so if i were to move it to one you can see the bricks here get a lot smaller let's let me do that again four a good example is also just looking at this here and now you can see how this makes more sense and adding this in your game is super easy all you have to do is go to polygon select free download download the zipped file go into the folder look for the brick image that you think works best for you go into the cube under 3d model and just drag and drop. So I selected this file, drag it over here. Now it is a JPEG file, which I was surprised that worked in BuildBox, but it does, so that's great. And now I'm gonna adjust this to four on the texture scale, just because I like the way it looks. And then in this example, we can see we have the big brick, we got these little bricks, and I, I set up this brick so that when you touch it, it explodes. that and then even here we have these marble looking objects which I've set to if touch and the ability to move and here's like a rusty rust box as well let me go in and actually make some of these bigger because the bigger they are the easier they are to look at so let's go ahead and drop this like this and hit play So this one's got like a marble look. This one's got like a little, a bunch of little pebbles. Gets a little weird at the top. So this might be better for a cube. And then this is like the rusty object and it's flying away. Oh, then this one also is a little bigger. So all you need to do is download the file and then drag it to 3D model under texture. And from here, you can also adjust the lighting and the hue saturation. I would be careful with this. So yeah, that's a quick, easy way to add a texture, something like a brick wall in your game to give it a more lifelike feel or whatever texture you think looks cool. I hope you found this video useful. If so, please hit like and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have any things you would like to see clarified in BuildBox, please let me know. And until next time, stay safe and peace.